Hi Aries, welcome to your tarot video scope for March 2015 by uh, Ama. So uh, soon as I open the cards, uh, I'm immediately picking up of uh, you getting back your own power, being given more responsibility. There's an opportunity here that has to do with uh, a real estate, a real estate uh, property, family matter. Opportunities to make sudden opportunities for uh, little financial gains. A lot of creativity in the air, creative spirits. Opportunities to change your world for the better. And this time I have an extra card because this card wanted to come up. So let me break it down for you one by one. What does it mean? Okay, so most of you Aries in March, and for some of you it is also your birthday, so happy birthday. For uh, most of you, there's some issues, legal issues here going on with uh, property, family matter. And it is in March where I see this being resolved, when I see everything being um, sorted out and where justice will be done for everybody involved. So uh, the result of this, this trial or this uh, uh, legal matter regarding uh, issue around a home or a property family matter, so a property through the family, uh, the, the, uh, the judgment, the result of the legal matter will be very fair. Everybody will get what's uh, theirs. So, uh, let's say in the first and the second week of uh, March, you are in the spotlight. No matter what kind of job you're doing, whether you're looking for a promotion, whether you're looking to uh, be tested, whether you're looking to be uh, valued for uh, your creative sides, uh, maybe you have a talent and now it's you decided that it's time for you to take the spotlight It's time for you maybe to go uh, To a performance or even at work if you think that now it's the time that You want to take more responsibility uh, at work. You want to upgrade your uh, status at work. Maybe take taking more uh, uh, more of a managerial role Chances are that this will happen in the first or the second week of March. Not only that, but it seems like this opportunity will be offered to you in a very unexpected uh, way. So that's good for you. That's uh, even a better opportunity for you to advance your career. It's a better opportunity for you, of course, for uh, to make more money for financial gains. But when this happens, you also have to be careful because not everyone around you will be happy about this. Not everybody around you will genuinely uh, come there to con congratulate you for this offer or this opportunity that you are given. Because there's also other people around you who they think that that spotlight or that uh, position offered belong to them. So don't worry about that, it's just uh, something that will last for a couple of days, nothing to worry about that. I mean, jealousy, uh, it is a human uh, feeling, it will, go, it will go away. So you don't have to worry about that. So in terms of this new position or this new financial and business opportunities coming to you, you will have to make a decision especially when it comes to the first 12 days of March so an answer is expected from you you do have to make this decision and there's a lot of contemplation here whether am I worth it am I going to be good enough am I making the right decision is it time for me to take more responsibility am I ready to take on this uh, responsibility now this sort of responsibility can be also given to you in family matters so if you don't work and that doesn't apply to you then it means that if you stay home 
that means that that responsibility will be given to you in, in, in a family matter, through other family matters. So they will put you in charge to uh, resolve uh, a family matter. When it comes, uh, but toward the end of the month, is it when the big opportunities, where sudden opportunities, little uh, opportunities to make little money here, little money uh, there. So the offers are not done for you just yet. So of course there is that big offer for you to uh, to be a manager or to be in a supervision or in a much more powerful position in your job in, or in your career. But then besides that, we do have for you a little opportunities to make little money. That can also mean that this money, it's not money that you do have to work hard for it. This money can be coming through clients, kind of a job or a, a, um, a job that you do on a side or through a talent and an ability that you have. But this may also come through uh, uh, through the creative side of you. So March is a very powerful month for you in terms of your creativity. Not only will you will come up with very creative ideas to come up uh, uh, to come out of any uh, difficult situations, but for those of you who do want to create a child, there is a lot of creativ creativity in the, in the air if you do desire a, a child. March is the month when you will be blessed with creating this uh, child. Now, for those of you who are not looking to create a child, but you are looking to start a creative project, like uh, in the artistic term, like starting to write a book, starting to paint, starting uh, anything that has to do with uh, media or communicative arts, even for those of you who are uh, who are teachers, because you do have to be in front of a group group of people and to teach your students, so therefore you all, uh, you have to be on the spotlight. So this is a great month for you to start those creative projects, because so far you just been building up on uh, feelings, on ideas. This is you just. Uh, building up on ideas, on materials, financial goods, uh, legal rights or legal knowledge, everything that you need to do in order for this uh, creative idea now to be put uh, to plan. So this is a great opportunity for you that would allow you to finally move up to the next stage of your plan, to move up to the next stage of your uh, life. Now, when I spoke about sudden opportunities to make uh, money, for some of you it means that um, because uh, the idea is that you won't have to work hard for this money, that means that a little percentage of you, some of you, may get lucky in like scratch tickets. It's, it is not a lot of money, but it is a little money associated with it. It can just be five dollars, it can just be ten dollars, it can be a hundred dollars, but still it is a little money that the universe wants to give to you and you don't have to work uh, hard for it. Now, uh, for those of you who are coupled, this card means that there's better opportunities here to make your relationship uh, more creative in the idea of, you know, you kind of are bored in your relationship as of, as of right now, you need to do something different. And this card offers you uh, as a couple to come up with creative ideas on how to communicate better, how to strengthen your communication. But to strengthen your communication uh, in the sense of uh, how do you connect mentally with each other? How do you connect spiritually with each other? So, um, the, so this card denotes and is giving you the opportunity to uh, work better for a better understanding with your uh, partner. Where is it that you think something is not working? Where is it that you think that your relationship needs some healing to do? Uh, for those of you who are single, this card not, all, not only is offering you opportunities to make more money, sudden opportunities to advance your career and to take like a higher position, but this is also love being offered 
so if you are single and if you are uh, open to dating and if, if you are looking this is someone uh, offering his love this is someone asking you out on a date so there is a lot of change there is a lot of creativity there is a lot of spiritual healing in the air for you there is a lot of opportunities to make better money and if you are smart if you benefit from this if you don't say no if you take these opportunities then the world as you know it will start to change for the better but you do have to benefit from this you do have to start that idea that creative project that you've been boiling in your mind and i know you have you have a very uh creative uh, mind i know that you uh, had this idea so now it's time for you to start writing down those notes to start maybe you had an idea how uh to be your own boss or how uh to advance your career so now it's the time for you to start working and to plant the seeds to take the first step towards uh, the plan because chances are that this plan will work out better than you initially thought it won't be easy that transitioning phase won't be easy there are a lot of uh, spiritual emotions here a lot of fears psychological fears anxiety but uh, if you want to achieve that greatness that is meant for you of course you have to go through a transition and of course you have to deal with this uh inside fears and your doubts and having to consider where is your strength and where you need to work uh, more so if you do benefit from this if you start uh, that project now then the world as you know it it will change for the better you are the one who will ignite who will start these positive changes coming into your life so if you start now chances are they i am told uh august september for some of you is august september if you start to plan your seed now in any plan that you have whether it is legal matters family matters uh, creative artistic uh, matters even having to move even having to build a new house uh, having to work on a business partnership like which promises wow tons of uh, money for those of you who are in the uh, financial world if you do start now most of you will see the benefits of, of this through October September and for the rest of you who are just coming up with a creative idea or any other kind of project I'm told that the moment you start if you do start in uh, March it might happen uh, you will see the actual financial results from this uh, 10 months after you start but you do have to start in uh, March this is an authority figure here this is an authority figure so whatever you do you will end up uh, face to face with this authority figure. Some of you will have a job interview or a reevaluation or uh, uh, some sort of evaluation from this authority figure. He is very hard to please. Believe me, if this authority figure says that you are good in doing something if they say that they do want to offer you all that opportunity believe me they mean it it's not one of those authority figures they just need someone right away this guy because i'm sensing mostly like a male authority figure here for most of you this guy is really hard to please he doesn't make friends uh right away he's very private in his workplace nobody knows anything about his private life uh he's very authoritarian and he doesn't give compliments easy he's, he's very hard to please so for you to be chosen f by him from him uh to be given this opportunity from him it, it is a big deal and it is well deserved so this is you now having again having to do more soul searching for most of you uh how do you feel about this do you want to take uh this position this opportunity offered to you now for some of you it can just it can also mean that you went to, uh, to uh, audition you didn't hear from them right away because um uh, the people who uh, the casting people they seems to be very hard to reach 
but you will hear from them afterwards so you will get a no or a yes right away because they like to examine every single uh, ca candidate for uh, who was invited to this uh, audition so you do have to do a lot of soul searching to see how you feel about this you do have to do a lot of uh, not all, not all, uh, not only soul searching, but you have you have to have the proper knowledge. If you are the one who is offered um, um, a higher position at work, if you are offered a new job, or even if you wanna open your own business and you just came up with that idea, so my advice would be uh, research. Uh, as much as you can, use every tool on the internet, come up with as uh, many uh, research ideas, data that you can because you do need to have everything open in the table. You do need to be 100% sure with uh, what is it that you're uh, uh, dealing uh, with. But this can also mean that because there is a sense of creativity, uh, in the air, you feel very inspired from all the events around you, from different people, from stuff that you might run into when you do a meditation, a soul searching, from stuff that you might hear on the radio, on TV, on the internet. So if you do get inspired from this, and you will be, uh, my advice would be, please write it down. Everything you hear, occasionally, Everything that idea will ignite that ding 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 a light will flicker in your mind and this is where your creative juices will come for those of you who want um who are working in a creative uh, project who want to feel inspired for anything or just inspired in general to uh, move on so write down your creative ideas or find a way to record them uh, somehow now because today instead of 10 cards i have 11 cards this card wanted to come up and there is no coincidence about that but this card is trying to tell me something it's trying to tell me that finally this is you owning your own power feeling more in power feeling more in charge having been given more responsibility for some of you it also means that now uh, you are your own boss it's time for you to start your own business to find a business if you were looking for one it also means that you are using the best of you to move forward and it's the best of you the best of your qualities the best of your work you gave it your a hundred percent so as a result now you feel like you gave it your best and now you are in charge you're the boss and you do own your own power this is you recognizing your power you and embracing that power and benefiting from it so uh, so generally generally there is a feeling of i would put it manifestation because i told you there's an inspiration in the air there's a creative charge in the air so if you do plant a uh, plant your seed now uh, you will be uh, rewarded towards uh august september for most of you and as i said if you, for uh, the rest of you that will take for about 10 months from the date that you st that you start so enjoy uh, March pay attention to every little detail or any little inspirational idea in the air because it will help you uh, greatly for months and months to come and months from now if you do look back at March you would realize that March was an important month for you even though you didn't understand the changes at first March was an important month for you when major things just started to happen from, uh, for you so if you do like my uh, reading and you do want a personal reading because this is just a general reading if you do want a personal reading please email me at almastudent2000 at yahoo.com I am very flexible uh, if you do have any, have any comments or questions, please do write them in the link below. I do have a Facebook page, I'm a Lightworker Psychic and Healer. Please uh, 
uh, like, share, and uh, subscribe. And let your friends uh, know about my uh, pre predictions. And I will see you next month. Until then, low and light.